no way is best in the protest. <laughs> you must not forget. As if you forget, you can tell me. I will buy the band. So when you come, I will tell you. <laughs> Han har noe typisk navn, men han vil ikke si det. Han kaller seg Rasmus. På grunn av alle skandinavene. Nå skal han vise oss en butikk som selger kjøtt, for det finner vi ingen steder. Vi lager middag hjemme. Nå har vi satt oss inn i en utfull bil. Jeg skal på tur. Jeg vet ikke hvor. Jeg håper vi kommer hjem igjen. I'm coming from North Wadan, it's, uh, it's like close to the middle of Turkey. Yeah. It's uh, some small town. People are coming to work here. The Wadan also because uh, there's not many work. Right, most of the Scandinavian girls, they are coming here for Turkish guy too, you know. Yeah. The, the Turkish guy in Alanya, they're heavy man. The Scandinavian girls, they are heavy. Yeah, so I've been in a serious relationship with Danish girl, for example. I had a baby from her. It's not possible. I cannot stay in Scandinavia, in Denmark, in Norway. I cannot stay there. They cannot stay here too. But do you want to live in Scandinavia? No, of course not. For uh, many Turkish guys, they want to go because they want to have a good life, they want to be happy there, but it's not uh, possible. The 90% of them, they came back. The 10% who stay in Denmark, in Scandinavia or just other countries, if you ask them, if you are happy or not, they're gonna say they are not happy. So I had a baby, you know, she's just a uh, part of uh, my body, just a piece of my bed. Even uh, that was uh, not enough for me to stay in Denmark. Girls get like rape. Well, his mind is just changed because of something else. 